Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Um, uh, today I want to share with y'all something I love to do, which is play sports. It, it's not really a specific sport to play. It's like any kind of sport. Uh, but it might not be for the reason that most people might think. It's really for the life lessons it teaches you. Because I hear like some of y'all come up here and say like basketball, football, baseball, I mean dancing and cheerleading, which is considered a sport to me. But um, and I like to hear how y'all talk about how y'all learn stuff from playing sports and how it uh, made y'all learn how life is. Uh, Cause in life there's up and down, just like sports has up, it's up and down. And I had experience where I had to deal with up and down uh, in life, where I wanted to play football, I played football, but I didn't really want to play, I wanted to quit. But when uh, I was too scared to tell my coach I wanted to quit though, because it was kind of scary. Uh, well, I had fake sick, because I, I didn't want to tell him, and it was day, one day, I saw him come uh, down the hallway because I was at school. And he asked me, uh, well, if you're sick, why are you at school? And I said, well, because uh, my parents want me to still do schoolwork. Well, he said, if you're that sick, then you can practice. And he said, well, if you, if you don't want to, because he knew that I, wasn't, I was faking. And he said, if you don't want to play football, well, then you should, if your parents are making you, then you should, we should go to, we could talk. We could talk to him and tell him that you don't want to play anymore. But I really think that he said he really think that I can play. He really think I'm good enough. He said, what, what would you think your coaches and your players would think of you if you do quit? So that made me think that I shouldn't quit. I should just stick with it. And I did stick with it. Um, and I just stick with it my freshman year. My sophomore year, he decided to let me start. And I started at tight end. If y'all don't know what tight end is, tight end is the uh, player that can line up with the line scrimmage, the old lineman. The, Oh, and I'm going to the people who can block, only can block. And, but a tight end can block and go out for routes and catch passes and stuff. So, there was this, like, a couple of practices later in some year. We had, like, five rows, five plays in a row where I had to catch, uh, had plays where I had to catch the ball. I dropped, like, every pass, every one. <laughs> and the next day, I got, he took me off a tight end. So, that really kind of made me upset. So I pra practiced like crazy, like every day, because I really wanted to play. Now, and a uh, couple, couple practices after that, uh, they had a practice team going against the first team. So they needed a tight end for the practice team. Of course, I'm going to go. So I get on there, and I do pretty good. I do real good. He's, then he comes to me and tells me that, you know, since you're doing real good at uh, at your position, I think you can you can start and you can you can play again. So that's that. That made me realize that there are ups and downs in life, just like there are in football. Like sometimes you might start at the bottom, then you get up top, then you go back down again, then you work your way back up. But that's pretty much all I have to say. But one day I want to tell you, tell everybody that. To see in life, you have to fail in life, because if you don't fail in life, then you won't figure out how to succeed, and that's all that's.